Hi, my name is Ann Wolf, and I'm a pediatric physical therapist at Emerge Pediatric Therapy. I am also part of our infant development team, which is a team of occupational speech and physical therapists that have additional training in infant development. Today, we are gonna be talking about use of the sideline position. So in addition to back to sleep, and tummy to play, sideline can be a wonderful way to give your baby some additional play positions that also have so many benefits. So sideline is just what you think it is. It's baby laying on their side, and it is an alternate position that you can use during playtime when baby is awake from birth. So as soon as you get home from the hospital, you can start rotating this into your wake windows. The benefits of sideline are that it's a gravity minimized position to bring hands to midline and hands to mouth. That means that it's easier for baby to bring their hands together here or to bring their hands to their mouth in this position. It is also a really nice way to de-weight baby's skull if you have a baby with plagiocephaly. So in this example, if baby is laying on their right side, so right side is down, that would be de-weighting the left side of their skull. So the side that is facing up is in a really nice de-weighted position. This can also be a great position for strengthening of the neck muscles, so particularly the lateral neck muscles as baby lays here and they try to work on lifting their head up. That is really strengthening the muscles on the side that is facing up. The sideline position is also a great position as a transitional functional movement. So you can start to use this for rolling from side back to their back. It's also great for side to their tummy. And eventually babies use the sideline position as a way to get up to sitting. So if your baby has a little bit of trouble staying here or they're very young and they still need some support, you have a couple options for modifications. You can have baby on their side with a towel roll behind them. You can also put baby on their side positioned with your leg behind them. That can also be a really helpful way to keep them in that position and to let you have your hands free so you can still play with baby or help support their hands coming together or hands coming to their mouth. Um, and just kind of give you a little bit more control over helping their body stay in that position. If you have an older baby and they can stay in that position on their own, then it can, that can start to be a great time to utilize it as a transitional position to start rolling. The biggest things to remember are make sure you're doing both sides equally. So if you use one wake window to do side length to the right, then use your next wake window to do side length to the left. It can also be a really nice position if your baby's not tolerating a lot of tummy time, just start in tummy time during a wake window and then after they have kind of shown you that they're no longer able to be in that position, then utilizing sideline to give them a little bit longer off of their back before you put them back to sleep. Um, if you have any questions about sideline position, please leave a comment and we can get back to you. Uh, I hope you found this helpful and that you can start using sideline as a play position with your infant.